I didn't know anything about um, the Able Powers Exchange. I knew about Gary Powers because all of us, and certainly I grew up in the 50s, 60s, all of us had heard that the U-2 spy plane had been shot down and Gary Powers had been put on public display, public trial. Um, but, but the story for me as a youngster kind of you know, ended with a spectacular you know, shoot down. And I didn't realize that something had happened subsequent to his capture, which was this very backroom exchange, spy swap, between Rudolf Abel, a Soviet spy, and Gary Powers, the American spy pilot. Two spies, in fact. So, so this is something that was brought to my attention by Matt Charman, who had come in to DreamWorks to uh, tell us the story that he had unearthed in his, in his interest in that period. And uh, when I first heard the story, it was hard to believe that for me, I listened to the story, I said, this sounds like a film, this sounds like a movie. Did, did this really happen? And uh, we certainly checked on the events and vetted his research, and absolutely the events that we depict in our film, the uh, actual events are absolutely true. I think the, the, you know, the character that Tom Hanks plays, James B. Donovan, you know, he, he was, I guess, what you would call the standing man or the stand-up kind of guy that stands up for what he believes in to be a, a, a universal truth, which is basically justice for all, uh, regardless of what side of the Iron Curtain you are on. In, in, in this case, um, uh, whether you were um, a communist, a, a Soviet spy, whether you, where your sympathies lied, it, it, he was only interested in the letter of the law. And, um, and so based on some technicalities, some flaws he found in the in the, uh, uh, the arrest of Abel and the illegal search and seizure of uh, his studio and his apartment, he was able to find some, uh, I guess, fissures in the state's case against uh, Rudolf Abel and was able to, you know, get a very good uh, defense uh, uh, underway. I thought Tom was the obvious choice to play to play Donovan, you know, um, you know, you know, you know, Tom's own morality and his own, you know, sense of equality and fairness, and and the fact that Tom does such good things in the world, you know, you know, by by using wisely, you know, his celebrity and his intelligence and his and his points of view. He has so many of them that I thought it was a good fit. Uh, to, to see if Tom would play uh, James Donovan.